class, uh, if I could have uh, your attention, I have some really important information uh, that has great bearing on your grade and your future. Uh, your life would be, I'm right over here. Um, like, your life will be miserable if you don't listen to me. Uh, you know, I have all the secrets of life, how to become a billionaire. I was going to share with you. I've been a teacher uh, for, for quite some time now, and it's just become very clear that students just do not care about paying attention in my class at all. Now, I can tell you, since we did the distance learning, the online learning, do whatever you want learning, it's only gotten worse. And, you know, I had to take some, some measures to, to solve this. And that's, that's why I hired, hired uh, Rocco as my TA. Now, he's a little unorthodox in his methods for keeping students on task, but I'll tell you what, it's uh, helped out so far, and I'm pretty curious to see how this all goes. Rocco's been interesting, to say the least. He doesn't necessarily have much sympathy for anybody, and whenever you try and justify what you're doing, he just says, no excuses! It's been really exhausting. <laughs> I don't like you. So it's definitely been more productive in class. I may, I may remember uh, last semester he would assign a news package and he'd say that the due date's in a week and then it would take another week and then another week. But now with Rocco around, it's, it's, it's been faster, I, I will admit. People are actually getting things done on time. I've been really loving it personally. This is about the best TA job I could have gotten. I mean, I'm so good at it that other teachers are asking for my services. I was even asked by some of the coaches to help encourage during PE class. Wait, hold on, this is important. You've lost privileges, buddy. What? Well, what are you doing, man? What are you doing? I need that. Why don't you just grab a Um. I, yeah, yeah, Rocco's, uh, he's, he's good. Uh, his, his means are very ethical and uh, uh, he doesn't work us to exhaustion, yeah. I'm calling your mom. The guy is a psychopath. He just took my phone for no reason. I mean, I, I'm practically done with my thing. And he just ran away with it. I don't know where it is. Drop and give me 20. Give me 20. I'm making you feel. Give me 20 right now. Down. 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 Damn. Rocco, stop. <laughs> you dropping. Well, I'm a, a bit conflicted about Rocco. Uh, don't get me wrong. He, he's a good kid, uh, but I think he's lost the trust to my students. He definitely changed the atmosphere. It used to be loud and kids doing all this kind of crazy stuff, and it was definitely annoying, uh, and, and that's, that's definitely changed. It's now quiet, but at least back then, kids wanted to be here. And now it looks like everybody's kind of like looking over their shoulders and uh, doing, going to great extreme measures to make sure that they're on Rocco's good side. Yeah, I, I think he's now gone too far and I'm gonna have to do something. Yeah. 